Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, we are going to solve another random board exam problem. So this is problem number 8. This is about algebra. Okay, in this problem guys, binigyan tayo ng dalawang equation, dalawang unknown. So, find x daw. So, 27 raised to x, okay, equals 9 raised to y. Yung another equation natin is 81 raised to y times 3 raised to negative x is equal to 243. Ayan, hanapin daw natin yung value ng x. Okay, so this is an algebra problem guys. Ang approach natin dito is basically the loss of exponent. Okay, so paparehasin lang natin guys yung mga base niya in order for us to actually get an equation out of the exponent. Okay, from equation number 1, uh, from equation number 1 that is 27 raised to x equals 9 raised to y. Okay, so eto guys dapat parehas yung base niya in order for us to actually equate the exponent. Okay, so ito guys, common factor niya is 3. Let's just change 27 na ang base niya is 3. So, that is 3 cube. Okay, 3 cube siya, yung 27. So, this is raised to x. Then, we have here, this is 3 squared. 3 squared ay 9. Then, raised to y. Ayan, same base na siya guys. Okay, ito, loss of exponent, pag ganyan, multiply lang natin yung variable. Okay, so this is 3 raised to 3x equals 3 raised to 2y. Ayan. Okay, ito guys, same base na siya. Therefore, we can actually equate the exponent. If 3 raised to 3x is equal to 3 raised to 2y, therefore, 3x is equal to 2y. So, this is our first equation. Okay, 3x is equal to 2y. Ayan. Therefore, okay, y in terms of x, that is y is equal to, okay, i-divide lang natin 2 both sides. Okay, so this is 3 halves x. So, this is our first equation. Then, let's go to the second equation. I-revise din natin siya in order for us to get the equation out of those exponent. Okay, so 81 raised to y. Okay, 81 raised to y. Then, you have 3 raised to negative x is equal to 243. Ayan. So, the rule guys, if you are multiplying the same base, okay, you just add the exponent. So, ito guys, hindi same base nya. Okay, so, ang gagawin natin, paparehasin natin guys yung base nya. So, 81 is divisible by 3. So, therefore, we can say that 81 can be expressed as 3. Okay, so, 81 is 3 raised to 4. Okay, raised to y. Then, we have here 3. Okay, raised to negative x is equal to. Okay, so ito guys, i-express din natin siya as a base of 3. Okay, so 243 is 3. Okay, 3 raised to 5. Ayan. Then, we perform the loss of exponent. Okay, so ito guys, 3 raised to 4y times 3 raised to negative x. And, we have here 3 raised to 5. So, that is equal 3 raised to 5. Then, ito, loss of exponent, same base, we can actually add the exponent. So, this is 3 raised to 4y plus negative x. So, this is equal to 3 raised to 5. Then, of course, this can be expressed as 3. You have here 4y minus x is equal to 3 raised to 5. Then, same base, we can actually equate the exponent. So, that is 4y minus x is equal to 5. Okay, so this is our equation number 2. Going back to equation number 1, so that is y. Okay, y is equal to 3 halves x. Okay, equation 1. Then, this uh, two equations to unknown, we can actually find x by substituting y to this second equation. I substitute natin yung y in terms of x. Okay, so that is 4 times the quantity we have here 3 halves okay 3 halves x minus x okay substitute lang natin equals 5 then perform natin yung algebra okay so 4 times 3 halves this is 
Okay, that is 6x minus x is equal to 5. Okay, so 6x minus x, that is 5x. So, equals 5. Divide both sides by 5. We get x equals 1. Okay, so therefore, x is actually equal to 1. Okay, so that is... Okay, that is letter A. So, letter A is the answer for this past board exam problem. Okay, guys. Madalas din lumabas itong mga problem na ganito in the engineering board examination. So, the approach is uh, algebra and loss of exponent. That's it, guys, for today's video. If you are new to this channel, just click the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you'll get notified on our future videos just like this one. See you guys on my next video. God bless and stay safe.